friends, how are ya? Welcome back to my channel for such a good day. You guys know I am so in love with Everlane. I wear Everlane probably 95% of the time, even right now. <laughs> and it's been a couple months, but finally I am back with another Everlane haul for us to get to look at a lot of their new spring arrivals, try them on, get first impressions, see how they fit, see what we love. And I am beyond excited. I even, oh my gosh, guys, they have swimsuits now and I have never ever had a swimsuit from Everlane and I just absolutely adore them and I cannot wait to try them on. Actually, this package arrived yesterday afternoon when there was like almost no sunlight left and I was like, can I film it tonight? Cause I just cannot wait any longer. <laughs> this video is sponsored by Everlane. So because of that, I will have all these items linked down below and those links do help to support my channel. I think we should just get straight into trying things on cause we have a lot. What do you say? The first thing I wanna try on, I am so excited about these cause I think they'll be really good for my body type. They came out with a new high rise jean called the 90s cheeky jean and the curvy cheeky jean is my favorite. I am actually wearing it right now. So I love this one. I got it in two different washes. We have like this deeper blue wash and then also this lighter blue patched denim look. So I'm really, really eager to see how it fits my body type. I'm much more pear shaped than a lot of jeans are made for. So I'm excited to see how this fits my body shape. Let's start with the darker denim. Okay, these are really cute. I'll have to show you them in the mirror. I will say I got a size 25 and I'm usually between a 25 and a 26. And I think I would size up to a 26 if I got these again. They are a little tight around the hips, but they also look super flattering. I love that there's buttons up the front. My favorite part is the way they fit around the ankle though. So let me take you to the mirror. This is how the full length looks. I got regular length. I'm five foot seven for comparison. And they have like a cropped or an ankle length. And I love the length of the regular on me. And they're definitely much more relaxed around the ankle than my other jeans from them. Here Here's what they look like in the back. And I do really like the rise of these. But if you're a hippie like me, I would maybe suggest sizing up, especially if you're kind of between sizes. Oh my gosh, I love these. And what's so interesting, this is also a 25 in the 90s cheeky jean, but this patched denim actually has a slightly looser fit. So I would actually keep a 25 and stay in a 25 in these. These are so cute. Yet again, love the rise super flattering on the butt and then i love that there's just a little extra something with that patch detail i'll show you full length are these not just so fun i really really love these i don't have anything even remotely similar to these so i'm really excited and i love how the patch is like slightly asymmetrical it looks almost like handmade you know what i mean i really really like these are so fun <laughs> while i have these pants on let's try on some shirts I got multiple kind of linen-y textured shirts, which is my ideal aesthetic. I am so excited about them, so let's, let's try them on. First, I got, this is the linen utility shirt, and I got it in two colors. This is honey, and this is the color that growing up my mom always told me, like, that is your color. For your skin tone, that is your color. So as soon as I saw this color, I was like, oh yeah, I gotta get it. Also, I went to UT Austin for a semester, and half the reason I went there is their color is kind of similar to this, and I was like, at least I look flattering in merch. And then I moved to LA, so hook up. <laughs> but I love that this is slightly cropped so you can kind of still see the high rise of the pants And I just love the fabric of this It does have like a kind of utilitarian feel with the cuffed sleeves and the pockets But it has a very chic feel overall. Oh my gosh This would actually look so perfect with the shoes. I got slight shoe intermission I'm so excited to see these in real life. These are called the city sandal <gasps> Oh Look at these Oh gosh, I love these. These are just right up my alley. I love how there's a little bit of a heel, so it feels a little bit extra something something, but then they're also slip on. Would this not be the perfect outfit? I think I think we're due for a mirror shot and I'm gonna try these on. Oh my word, this is a whole look. This is a whole vibe right here. I love it so much. What do y'all think? Do you think that this is like the aesthetic I should go for this spring? Because I definitely do. Oh, this is the same shirt in canvas check. 
I really like this one too. Now I don't know which one I like more. This one is just such a vibe. <laughs> this feels like Joshua Tree, very cool chic. So I wanna know which one you like better between the honey or the canvas check. Still goes so well with my sandals and my light wash jeans. Here's a close up look at the material. This material has a little bit more softness to it than the darker color, but I love that you can just tell by looking at these that these are linen. Mm. Oh my gosh. Okay, now we're getting into like the warmer spring days. This is adorable. This is the linen picnic top in Laurel. And for size references, I got everything in a small or a two and then all my pants in a 25. I just absolutely adore this. It's so lightweight and breezy, but it still is very put together. Yet again, has that gorgeous linen feel and detail. And I love this neckline. I love how even though it's a spaghetti strap, it still feels very kind of modest. You know, I still feel like free to be, <laughs> free to frolic. And I feel like this would be so stinking cute with like a, a mustard yellow hair tie tied around as like a headband and like a fun big woven tote. You get the, you get the feel I'm going for. I love it so much. Speaking of linen, I got two linen jumpsuits and I've had some of their linen jumpsuits previously and lived in them all spring and actually all summer because they were so lightweight and breezy. So I'm really excited to try on this year's jumpsuits. Let's do that next. Oh my gosh. I love them just as much as last year. Okay, a couple things I love about this. First, you do not have to coordinate an outfit at all. You don't have to put any thought into it. You put on one item, it's a full outfit and you just look so put together. Second is these straps are thick enough to where you can actually wear your bra underneath and you can't see them even from the back. And I just love how easy it is. And they're so breezy. If it's like a cooler day, it's super cute with a cap sleeve t-shirt underneath it. And then summer, just wear it like this and I'll show you in the mirror how stinking cute it is. Do you love it as much as I do? It's so easy. The tie waist is incredibly flattering. Everything about it. It's honey again, that color that I love. It's my favorite color in my favorite most worn item from last year from Everlane. So I'm just so excited about this. I swear guys, I, between these two, you're not gonna see me in hardly anything else this summer. <laughs> <laughs> Yet again, so flattering. I also feel like I always have to preface and say I'm not pregnant whenever I talk about this. Without this tie waist, there's actually a good amount of room for like your first, at least your first two trimesters. If you're one of my pregnant friends, I know I got a lot of you. I think that'd be really stinking cute. So you can get this and wear it before, during, and after your pregnancy, honestly. <laughs> Guys, I am so in love. <laughs> If you watch my vlogs, you know I have been living in the perform sets from Everlane. They're surprisingly affordable, especially compared to a lot of other brands that I love. And it is so hard for me to find a sports bra. I have kind of wide set boobs. <laughs> so it's hard for me to find one that has good coverage on the side, but isn't like painfully tight. It still has support. And so I've just loved, loved their sets, but look at this color combination. It is like checkered. It is the cutest thing. And it's in my color. I really truly feel like they were like, oh, Mikkel needs this and made it for me. <laughs> the rise of these comes to the most flattering spot. It's like, oh, Everything about it is just so perfect. It has a good amount of hold and stretch without being like overwhelmingly tight as far as leggings go. It's like a perfect medium. Here's a look at the back. I'm so excited that they're coming out with patterned ones and I hope they continue doing it because I want them all. Now for the thing we've all been waiting for, at least I've been waiting for, <laughs> is the swimsuits. I can't decide if I want to do the high-waisted two-piece first or the one-piece first. <sighs> You'll have to be surprised. I am so in love. And do you know how hard it is to find a swimsuit that you actually like? I have gone on like full out shopping days, trying on hundreds of swimsuits and genuinely not like any of them. And I love this. This is the Renew High Rise Hipster and the Renew Square Neck Top. I got them both in small. I was a little nervous if I should get a small or a medium for the top and the small actually fits great. It's not too tight. It has like good comfort level. And I love the rise of these. This is just so flattering. It's so hard to feel confident in a swimsuit sometimes. And so when you find one that makes you feel confident, it's like, the best feeling in the world. I, I feel so happy in this. I'm so excited about it. Ah. I'm honestly like borderline emotional about how much I love all this because it's when a brand really gets you in your aesthetic and you just love everything. It's like finding a friend that you just get, 
you know? And how cute is this one piece? The thing I love about it is from the front, there's the square neck detail, but otherwise it's a pretty simple cut until you see the back. And it has this like dip down swoop in the back, which I think is just so fun. Also, whenever you wear <laughs> bikinis all summer, you know how you get that tan line that goes across here? This is a great way to try to even out that tan line. A hack to a swimsuit like this too, is you just throw on high-waisted shorts or even a high-waisted skirt as like a bodysuit throughout the day. Like if you're going to brunch and then the beach or you know, pool or something later. And it's a really cute outfit and then you just have to take off your skirt and then it's your swimsuit. So that is something that I really, really love about One Pieces. Thank you all for watching this video. I also wanna say if you're a person that hangs out over here a lot and you're not subscribed, it means so much to me if you wanna go ahead and press that subscribe button and officially be a part of what I call this giant online friend group. That's what helps me be able to continue to produce videos. So I always appreciate it a ton. And thank you to Everlane for sponsoring this video. You're my favorite forever, forever, and I adore you. <laughs> you just have the cutest clothes, let's be honest. Again, I'll have all those things linked down below and happy Friday bonus video. I love y'all with my whole heart. I hope you have the best rest of your day and I will see you in a video very soon. Bye. So give me a sign. Give me a sign. Oh, give me a sign. Baby, give me a sign. One more talking to you Here we go again Staying up all night to see if you've been texting me Where do we go from here? I wanna go all